Designer Logic exports purchase orders that are formatted to bring into the accounting program zero. This allows you complete control over what goes into your accounting and when, without having to retype any data. So the first thing you want to do in Designer Logic is set it up by going to the Manage Account page and make sure that zero is selected as your accounting export. In this video, we're going to use the Australian version of zero as an example. So after you have this set up, go over to Orders. And here you'll see a list of all your purchase orders in Designer Logic, and you want to come click Download for Zero. And all those purchase orders with all their items are going to show. And you want to filter this list by the way that you want to download it. So you can do it by date range, you can do it by supplier, project, a number of different ways. We're going to just select two purchase orders manually here and filter it by that. Now I just want to click Download to download those purchase orders. Click the um, Select All button and then mark them as exported. Now you have this um, exported to a CSV file. So if we go over to zero and we're on zero's dashboard, we want to go to business and go to purchase overview and then click import. And here we have zero's uh, import tool. Now you don't need to download the template. Designer Logic already formatted it for you. So just hit the select file button and browse to the download of purchase orders that you just did in Designer Logic. Click open. Down here you can either ignore the address updates or not, and you can also leave it as tax exclusive or inclusive. Um, Designer Logic will tell you whether it's taxable or not, so we're just going to choose this option. Click Confirm, hit Complete Import, and now you can see that we have these two bills. And if we open them, you'll see here we have this bill with the information on it, tax and everything with the total ready to go and all the description. And if we go back to Designer Logic, we can see that that's this bill right here, which has all the designer logic information, including a lot of tracking info and other integrated stuff with the project. So you can have all of your tracking and your purchase orders in designer logic um, that are integrated with the entire project um, really tightly, and then have your accounting um, all in zero so that you can have your business granular accounting in one place.